and welcome back to another travel video. This time we are in the southwest of Germany on the banks of the Mosel River. In this tour, we'll be visiting Koben Gondorf, Kochem, and Beilstein. You can easily visit all three places by train and route Koblenz Trier or by local bus. The Mosel Valley is known for its picturesque landscapes of lush mountains terraced vineyards and of course the Mosel River. Both sides of the river are dotted with lively little villages against the backdrop of medieval castles and ruined fortresses on hilltops. These little towns are so beautiful and magically inviting. So join us and explore the towns of the Mosel Valley. One and a half kilometers from the main station of Koben Kondorf lies Mühlental, a small neighborhood at the foot of a vineyard. This place is famous for one particular reason and that is this historic mill turned into a winery and a restaurant. The old mill dates back to the 11th century. The unique ambience paired with the Mosel Franconian dishes they serve makes it a truly regional experience. Kochem. Lying on the left bank of the Mosel River, this gorgeous German town offers that Mosel landscape for which this region is famous for. A medieval castle on the top of a vineyard, a panorama bridge, timbered buildings and medieval flair. Being a popular tourist destination, Kochem's cafes and restaurants are crowded. The ones along the main road have their entrances on two sides, one face in the river and the other face in the romantic alleys of the old town. It could be a tough choice to decide which side you want to sit. The old town is full of boutiques and outdoor cafes. Linger in this adorable market square, you literally hear corks of wine popping. Wine shops offer wine tasting before you buy the product and the regional wine seem to pour down the narrow alleys of Kochem making sure you don't miss the point that you are on the wine trail. After a short drive from Kochem, you reach Beilstein. Known as the sleeping beauty of the Mosel, this tiny town sits along the Mosel in fairy tale manner. Unlike the other two towns, Beilstein cannot be reached directly by train, but you can take the local bus from Kochem or take the seasonal river cruise. The markings on the wall shows the height the water reached during each floods.
Many Mosul visitors consider Beilstein to be the most beautiful and romantic Mosul town and I definitely agree. Once you sit in this market square from the 14th century, it makes you forget everything else and you just sit there for hours and hours. Beilstein has only about 160 residents and they rely on tourism and wine growing. Hence, you will encounter wine taverns and cozy romantic guest houses throughout this fairy tale town. This ends our short tour along the Mosul. It was a great pleasure making this video for you all. So hope you liked it as well. And if so, please like and subscribe to Karuna channel. I'll see you soon.